Royal biographer Angela Levin said during an interview with the conservative woman that Meghan has expansive spending habits. The author of Harry, Conversations with the Prince, said the Duchess's spending had not been well received. She said, I think Meghan on occasion has been extravagant, which has not gone down well. The Queen is known to be frugal and some members of the British public have balked at a proportion of their tax going towards what they consider to be frivolity. One example Miss Levin lists is the dress Meghan chose to be photographed in to mark her engagement to Prince Harry, which was believed to have cost £56,000. Another example is Meghan's baby shower in New York, which allegedly cost more than £300,000. Miss Levin continued, more significant was her baby shower in New York which was estimated to cost more than £300,000, an excessive amount whoever offered to pay for it, especially for someone who calls herself a humanitarian. The royal biographer also claims that Meghan's spending is one of the reasons why the Duke and Duchess's staff and offices are moving to Buckingham Palace. She said, it is, so I have been told, one of many reasons why all Harry and Meghan's staff and offices are in the process of moving to Buckingham Palace, where even their newly hired PR director, Sarah Latham, will be expected to report to the Queen's communications secretary. However, Miss Levin also believes it is early days for the Duchess, who hopefully become less show business and more royal. In January, royal fashion experts, UFO No More, calculated that Meghan spent £406,662.55 in 2018 alone. However, according to 2019 documentary Secrets of the Royal, Meghan's spending habits pale in comparison to the late Queen Mother. According to royal correspondent Ingrid Seward the late Queen Mother had a great style, and she never thought about the cost of anything. She said, she just wanted to look wonderful and be wonderful and for people to really enjoy themselves. She always had her own bottle of champagne in front of her. According to a 2018 report by Town & Country magazine, the Queen Mother's costly lifestyle led to an unbelievable debt of £7 million when she died in 2012.